So here we are today at the Thrive facility, um, going through our first rock drill in 2021, um, where we are planning in detail exactly how we're going to energise the offshore substation in an incredibly safe, but also quick and effective way. So normally with a rock drill, we get about 100 or so people together in a, in a large meeting room with diagrams all over the floor, bits and pieces of Lego and models. And we bring them together and have people actually moving them physically around and exploring the program and planning process together. What we have to do today because of COVID is do exactly the same thing, but with people thousands of miles apart. Some of our people are in Singapore, some of them are across Europe, some of them are spread out throughout the UK. And what we have to do is we have to use things like uh, Simply Video, Mirrorboard, and this enormous, wonderful screen and facility here, along with a bunch of really clever cameras to get a very similar sort of effect. It's a very smart way in order to have a virtual rock drill with cutting edge technology. Uh, and in actual fact, nothing of this scale has been done with this technology before in the world. So, as you all know, that uh, we've got a very condensed programme as soon as the offshore substation is going to land uh, in UK waters. So, in order to safely execute that condensed programme, the purpose of today is to engage with all the stakeholders to ensure they familiarise what activities are happening at the offshore substation and also on the RCS, um, make them familiarise, make a program which is, uh, which is an executable but in a safe way and towards the end of this rock drill we want to make sure that every single party who's going to be working offshore they understand what they're going to be executing, when they're going to be executing and they're also making sure it's done safely. Well the planning process is really important at this point in the stage of Haunted 2 projects. Um, we've got a substantially busy year ahead of us. Um, several work fronts coming together, all culminating in a, a very busy construction and commissioning period. Um, what this rock drill will allow us to do is uh, get everybody into one room, have a really good thorough detailed look week by week as we get through this process and let everybody else um, kind of throw, throw stones at it, see where we have any, uh, any opportunities to improve what we're planning. The reason the rock drill is really important is that I mean, this year we've got uh, the major offshore activities uh, ahead of us, so which includes the, the the substation going in and the reactive compensator station going in, all the turbines going up. So coming into or having something like this, an event like this, where people can come and look at the plan, look at the detail of the plan, uh, rehearse it here, look at any of the uh, the issues that we may have before we go offshore. This is the time really to get them solved. We need to get everybody physically in a room. Uh, that we couldn't get into, so we have to do that virtually. Um, we've used a company called Simply Video, um, who put us in touch with real wear headsets, um, and these are all wearable um, devices that you put on your head, and it has a first person view of what everyone in the room can see. Well, the rock drill was like no other. It was absolutely phenomenal. The engagement, both virtually and in the room, was incredible. The amount that people learnt, the, the way in which we've managed to capture that information and very, very swiftly turn around queries and questions has been second to none. It has been, you know, a beyond marvellous day and a real sort of the epitome of plan, care and communicate. How people put effort into creating the day, uh, put effort into delivering the day, work together in order to solve problems in real time, take care about one another and had incredibly good communication at a time when communication and connections are harder than ever. So, you know, one of the things that I think is so important is to, is to really recognise the amount of effort that everybody's done. Everybody from the people here in, Thri in the Thrive facility, the people who have spent time setting it up, the people in the background who've, who've, who've done all the hard work with the technology, and of course the audience who have engaged at this very difficult time. So thank you all so much, putting that extra effort to communicate together and to work together for an absolutely phenomenal project. Thank you so much.